Hi everyone. If you're a computer administrator or share a computer with other people, perhaps with your kids or your spouse, you may want to prevent access to the settings app and the control panel to avoid misconfiguration. There are two ways to do that on Windows 10 and Windows 11. If you're on Windows Pro Edition, you can disable the access from the local group policy. First, log into your PC as an administrator. Then click the Start menu button, type GP Edit, and then click Edit Group Policy. On the Local Group Policy Editor, expand Administrative Templates under User Configuration, and then click Control Panel. On the Control Panel items on the right pane, double-click the Prohibit Access to Control Panel and PC Settings. On the Policy Settings dialog, click Enabled. Then click Apply, and then finally click OK to close the dialog. Now the Settings app and the Control Panel should not be accessible. Okay. Now let's switch to a standard user account and see the effect of this policy. So all users will not be able to open the settings app and the control panel. And now if you need to enable them back, simply follow the same steps, but now set the policy to not configured. All right. Now if you're on Windows Home Edition, you have to do it from the Windows Registry. The tricky part of this method is that the registry key to prevent the access to these apps has to be added to every standard user who shouldn't be given access and has to be added by those users in their user environment. Adding this registry key by running the registry editor as an administrator while in a standard user environment will not block the access for that standard user, but instead it will block the access for the administrator that adds the key. To make this thing clearer, let's just put it into practice. So first, make sure that all standard users have been logged out and then log in as an administrator. Then open settings. On the settings menu, click accounts and then click other users. Change the account type of the standard user to administrator. This will be temporary until we finish adding the registry key. Now switch to this user. Once the user is logged in, click the start menu button Type regedit, and then click Registry Editor. On the Registry Editor, expand HKey Current User, and then Software, Microsoft, Windows, and then Current Version. Scroll down and look for Policies. Right-click this key, select New, and then click Key. Name the new Key Explorer. Now right-click the Explorer key, select New and then click DWORD 32-bit value. Name the new value, no control panel. Then double click the value name and set its value to one. That's all we need to add to the registry. Now, if we try to open the settings app, you will not get anything. And if you try to open the control panel, you will get an error message. But please take note that on Windows 10 or older version of Windows 11, you may need to restart your PC for the new registry key to take effect. Now close the registry editor and log out from this user environment. Then log in as an administrator and change the user type back to standard user. All right, so that's how you can prevent access to the settings app and the control panel. I hope you find this tutorial useful and thank you for watching.